Tonight, three downtown Raleigh businesses in the middle of a major drug investigation. Thanks for joining us. I'm Liz Ortiz. Everybody, I'm Russ Bowen. Two bar employees are among those facing charges in a case the ALE calls part of a larger drug and alcohol enforcement operation in downtown. It comes just two weeks after a major drug trafficking bust on Glenwood South. CBS 17's Maggie Newland is live in the downtown area with the details. Maggie, you've been on this all day. What have you learned? Russ and Liz, two employees and a customer here at the Big Easy are charged along with customers at two other downtown bars. Investigators say they were caught selling drugs. Courtney McGlone is a big fan of the Big Easy in downtown Raleigh. This is a, a staple for people here. He and friend Tyler Bailey say they're surprised to hear that two employees are charged with conspiracy to sell cocaine and other drug related charges after an investigation by alcohol law enforcement agents. Honestly, it's, uh, it's kind of shocking. Like I said, it's a very well-maintained area. It's a very good atmosphere. ALE says a customer is also charged with selling cocaine and marijuana. The owner of the Big Easy says he had no idea this was going on. Both employees charged worked at the bar for less than a year and are now out of a job. I think this is an isolated incident. McGlone says he manages several other downtown bars and tells us it's a tough job. We're all a very big family around here. Not, not only are you, do you have to be a professional, but you still have to run a party. Customers of two other downtown bars are also charged in connection with the ALE investigation. ALE agents say a customer of the Davy is charged with selling cocaine, and two customers of the Cardinal are charged with selling marijuana. The owner of the Cardinal says the bar is not complicit in any drug sales. We couldn't reach the owner of the Davy for comment. ALE agents say these charges come as part of a larger drug and alcohol enforcement operation downtown. McGlone says an ALE agent recently checked out his bar as well. He stepped right by my bar and looked at everything. I think that's how it should be. I think they're doing exactly what they need to do. And just a couple of weeks ago, a Raleigh firefighter and his wife were charged with drug trafficking. They are accused of selling drugs at nightclubs in downtown Raleigh as well as Glenwood South. Russ? And Maggie, I know you've talked to some of these bars. What are they planning to do moving forward? Well, I talked to the owner of the Big Easy after the charges were brought against his employees. He says he wants customers to feel safe here. He's talking about potentially bringing in some off-duty police officers to be here on the weekends to help people feel safer while they're here. All right, Maggie. Yeah, All right, Maggie, thank you.